What's the pain in me you wish you could heal? Describe the moment you realized you could fully trust me. Fully trust you? Yeah. Oh. oh. I feel like, oh man. I, I feel like it was like, even the first, like the diner? three weeks. Yeah. Yeah. Even like the first three weeks of us dating, mm -hmm. I feel like that kind of, just cause like, because like we took like a lot of like naps together before we learned like a thing. Yeah. <laughs> I've yeah. I, I feel like the museum date kind of solidified that, a like, lot. That like fifty hour date, yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. The first date, yeah. The first date. The first date yeah. solidified most things, mm -hmm. which is hilarious. I have this distinct moment when we were in the diner for the first time, and we were like talking, and I remember we were talking about like your family and all this stuff and yeah. going into like really deep things. Mm -hmm. And I had this moment of like, what, it's 4 a.m. <laughs> and we're in a diner and <laughs> we're talking about religion. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, okay. <laughs> <laughs> um, mm. When do you feel closest to me? It's kind of, weirdly specific and I d usually you're asleep <laughs> um it's after either like after a brain episode night like when something happens or like when we get in like not when we get in a tiff because we I wouldn't really consider it a tiff I would think of it more as like me getting <laughs> frustrated over <laughs> something that's not existent but I think it's usually after that and it's like when I go to sleep apart from you and I yeah. feel like there's always a time in the middle of the night where I wake up and I like want to be with you oh, and like yeah. be like hugging you or like touching you like not you know just like when I cuddle back up to you basically yeah when I realize like when I wake up in the middle of the night and I'm like what <laughs> what were you thinking? <laughs> and it's like one of those moments where I was like, why would I like waste time when we could have been mm. like cuddling, yeah. like turning my back to you, <laughs> if that makes sense. <laughs> I get that. Yeah, so maybe. Yeah, no, maybe I like that. it when it's like in the middle of the night yeah. and then like you just kind of. And it's funny cause it's such a tiny bed. So we're always like <laughs> touching, but it's like, there's a distinct moment of when I am like actively touching you, like actively. No, yeah trying to <coughs> yeah. like hug you. Yeah. yeah, so probably that. Mm -hmm. Okay. How did you first feel when I told you about my medical issues? Oh, yeah. Uh, I feel like I was like, I feel like I didn't like get it at first. So I was just like, yeah, like, like yeah, we could deal with it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> like, I just kind of figured like that and like, it was, it was one of those things where I, I was just like, like, all right, I'm just like, like I just ended up with a person that like has a lot of things and that's, <laughs> yeah. like that's it, you know? I mean like, yeah. <laughs> Cause yeah. I was just like, I guess we'll just have to deal with it. And I feel like you've gotten this far dealing with it. Mm -hmm. And plus like, it was in like an interesting time because like, your brain stuff had like just kind of like settled. Yeah. So I was just like, okay, like we seem to be doing okay. So, mm -hmm. and then like when it actually like started happening started and happening I had to like again, deal with yeah. it, I was like, oh man, okay. Yeah, like the first night. Yeah, cause that like, like it like scared me. I know, I was, yeah. really, I was really worried for you. Yeah. I was like, did you, did you talk to, <laughs> did you talk to someone about it? <laughs> Do you want to talk it through? Cause yeah. it is, it's scary. I'm like. You know, you know yeah. what I get. Yeah. So, 
It was, it was just like I was scared because I didn't know what to like do yeah. when you would have like an episode. Because mm-hmm. like, all how I w- could you? Yeah. yeah, yeah. Like all I would know is like you would I go to sleep, to wake up, and feel like a little better. So yeah. I was just like, just. just <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Um, and then meeting all the doctors, I was like, that was really boom, helpful. easy. Mm-mm-mm. You're like, got her. Brain, <laughs> easy, done. <laughs> <laughs> no worries. <laughs> yeah. What's the pain in me you wish you could heal? Answer that. Yeah. That's okay. I, like, like I feel like there aren't words, but we both know. Yeah. 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 Had a good cry. (laughs) (laughs) If we were to have a child, what kind of parent do you think I would be? Oh, I think you'd be a better parent than I would be. (laughs) I really think that. You're really... But like, actually? Yeah. I think I would get really annoyed. I think you'd be really patient. And I think you have a lot of paternal instincts. And all the time. <laughs> all the time. And I feel like I'm maternal with that, with that grimace. <laughs> like, uh, I think I am, but okay. I don't know. I feel, I feel like it's fine. I feel like it'll be a te- definitely a teaching thing, because, like, I've babysat. I know the whole diaper bit. Like, I feel like I know that, and it would be teaching you that, and then it would be you teaching me, like, patience and teaching them to grow up to be themselves, mm. like regardless of societal standards, I yeah. think. You know when they make fun of those parents in the movies who are like, no, like, what do you need? Be yourself, like, feel your truth. Oh, uh, we're, we're going to be the hippie parents yeah. of the class. Yeah. Which, <laughs> which, like, I'm a little excited for. No, yeah. But. I mean. Because, like, I'm going to pick up it. my kids like this, and I'm going to be like, hello, <laughs> I'm here now. You're wearing <laughs> floral leggings, so. Yeah. Yeah. I think that's the kind of parent you'd be. Okay. A good one. <laughs> Yay. Yeah. <laughs> okay. When we adopt. Ad- adopt. Adopt. Only adoption. Yeah. That was the thing that scared me. Oh, you telling me that you can't, yeah. Yeah. That was. Yeah. I remember, like, though, <laughs> we, we had, like, just had sex and you told me, right? Oh my God, did I? I think so. That's poor timing. <laughs> <laughs> or was it good timing? It was like, you have nothing to worry about. I can't get to <laughs> I still get nervous that I'm gonna be pregnant even though I'm on birth control, you wear condoms, and I can't have children. <laughs> and I'm still like, am I pregnant? <laughs> mm. Mm. <laughs> okay, is it my turn? Cool, 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 cool. How do you love me? Like the book that you made. <laughs> oh yeah. How much do you love them? Yeah. It's different. I know. How do I love you? I mean, like, how much do I love you? I love you. Oh my god. <laughs> like I literally like it's. Like I've never had the question of like, do I actually like this person? Do yeah. I actually love this person? It's like, so like set. That I love you. Yeah. And like. <laughs> what? I was just gonna say, yeah, I feel like even when we first started dating, we've yeah. always been that way. And I think people were always like, 
it's the honeymoon stage. It's the honeymoon stage. And you know people are going to be like, it's, it's only been a year. It's the honeymoon stage. But <laughs> yeah. for me, that's just going to be... I feel like that's just that's us. That's just going to be our lifetime. Yeah. yeah. And that's nice. And I like that. Yeah, me too. And I like you. What? <laughs> <laughs> I like you too. Hi, thank you so much for watching this video. If it was important to you and you want to support us, you can subscribe to our YouTube channel and keep watching. Thank you very much.